Don't trust the internet anymore? Well, some activists want to build a completely new one from scratch, but is it possible? In response to revelations about broad surveillance of mainstream internet services, a group of privacy advocates wants your help in building an entirely new, peer-supported internet from the ground up. The project called MeshNet has taken shape partly thanks to the Reddit thread Darknet plan, where contributors have been hashing out the details of this ambitious goal. Although advocates of Project MeshNet want to make it clear that it's not a Darknet project, it's an entirely new network that defines itself as a versatile, decentralized network built on secure protocols for routing traffic over over private mesh or public internet works. Here's how they describe that private mesh. Multiple computers are all connected to each other via a wireless connection spanning a large area. And all information, documents, messages, images, music, anything at all, is passed from computer to computer until it reaches its destination. If a computer or node is down, then an alternative route is found. All of this is done automatically by the computer itself, allowing the user to browse the mesh net as they would the regular internet. Likewise, all information sent and received is secure, meaning only the intended recipient is capable of receiving it. This means the architecture of the mesh net is owned by countless individuals instead of a handful of corporate providers, which makes the oppression of free speech impractical, bordering on impossible. How does that all work? Well, they've already established local networks in various cities, including Seattle, San Francisco, New York, and others. You can support these networks by getting a compatible router with CJDNS, which is part of the software component to the mesh network. Or you can install CJDNS on your home computer, but it takes a few steps and some technical know-how, which you can find instructions to on their wiki. Once installed, you can connect to a peer, and then you can access a secure peer-supported internet wonderland called Hyperborea, which visualizes looks like this, but consists at this point of a small list of known websites accessible only through CJDNS, including some private social networks, encrypted pastebins, a Reddit clone, and more. However, in spite of its limited size at this time, the fact that Hyperborea is off the grid, so to speak, is enough to attract activists and privacy-minded users to it regardless, some calling it inspiring and a necessary project for humanity. You can read more about the MeshNet project at projectmeshnet.org. So do you think this ambition of building a new internet co-op Operative from scratch is possible, and is it a good idea in your opinion? Let us know what you think in the comments. For TFN, this is Annie.